My name's Lewis from RNG Reptiles and Gaming and today we're doing a reptile video and we're looking at purchasing your very first snake. So if you're ideally from the UK and you're looking to get stuck in and to buy your first snake, then this video is perfect for you because we're gonna be looking at three things involved in purchasing your first snake. Number one is the type of snake you're after. Number two is the average price for these snakes at the moment on the market, let's say. And number three is probably the best place to get your snake either online or offline depending on whereabouts you live of course so without further ado let's jump into number one point number one the three species that i recommend the first species that i recommend is the king snake now the king snake is like a very big worm very very thin the girth of the snake is gets to about that sort of length i don't know if you can really see there about that sort of size um get to about five foot um, females will get the largest um, of course with all snakes females will get the largest so they get to about five foot uh, in max length out of the three how tame they are out of the three they're probably at number three so that doesn't necessarily mean that they're not tame it's just when we're comparing them to the other two they're at the bottom of the list so moving on to the second species on the list is the corn snake now I don't own a corn snake I never have done but I remember when I got my first snake back when I was 12 and they were the most popular snake on the market and I think that they were the first snake to hit the UK market and they are very similar to the king snake the same sort of length and also girth as well however I think out of the three they are number one in regards to tameness tameness sounds about right so moving on to number three out of the three species is the ball python also known as the royal python so the royal python i have myself nine of them i believe no eight i have eight ball pythons and they were my first snake so the first snake that i got was a ball python and i really recommend them as the number one out of the three but that's just my preference of course um, they are the chunkiest and the longest snakes out of the three so if you're interested in a bit more size a bit more girth as well sounds a bit weird but looking at the tameness i'll put number two um, out of the three for tameness um, they sort of lie in the middle definitely i think corn snakes still top it but to be fair they're probably around the same so out of those three definitely it will be a toss up between the corn snake and the ball python moving on to the second point price for these three different species so first of all let's look at the king snake so the king snake at the moment looking at hatchlings probably coming up at about 20 to 30 pounds and that's females will be slightly more than males but really in this sort of ballpark and this sort of price range it doesn't particularly matter so it's completely up to you i would suggest investing in a female regardless i would say that over all three species it's just to go for the female it's probably the best investment if you want to look at breeding and whatnot in the future you've got yourself a female so i really would suggest going with a female first um and then let's if we move on to the corn snake very very similar in price again but i'd say a little bit lower than that so around 15 to 35 pounds maybe 30 pounds um, because they were the first snake to hit the market there is such a surge in supply of those types of snakes especially the very common colors um, which means that the price overall will drop so i would say around 15 to 30 pounds maybe even less than that you could probably pick one up for maybe 10 or 15 pounds if you're really lucky so really just pennies absolute pennies to pick up snakes like this nowadays so moving on to the last species the ball python or royal python <clears throat> and i would say around the same park again so you're looking at about 20 to 40 pounds so same sort of ballpark so pretty much all three species you shouldn't really be paying any more than 40 pounds for them as a hatchling and i must stress this is the normal or the most common morph of snake when i say morph i mean the coloring of the snake i must stress that i would say do not pay any more than 40 pounds because looking at the prices at the moment on the market in 2017 you do not need to pay any more than 40 pounds moving on to topic number three or point number three point number three so where are we actually going to buy these snakes in the uk there is a great forum that i've been using now for the past 10 years and that is simply known as reptile forums and it's just going to be over 
over around here somewhere, Reptile Forums. I'll put a link in the description. Please check it out, guys. It's free to browse. Um, if you want to obviously post onto forums, create threads and whatnot, you need to sign up. It's very, very simple. It doesn't take too long, free of charge. Um, you can go in there and you can look at the classi classified sales. When you check the classified sales, you can see an array of people who are selling snakes or just giving them away because for certain family reasons or personal reasons, they don't need the snake anymore. So you can actually be picking up snakes for free on here. But if you're looking after, if you're looking for hatchlings, I would suggest, really suggest going onto this site, going into the classified sale bit, going into snakes, just checking it out, scrolling down, looking through all the snakes, the pictures that they offer, and it will also give you a location of where that person is so you can go and pick them up the next day. Um, providing that you just create an account with them, get in contact with them, and it's sorted. Um, it worked for me. I picked up five snakes with a lot of different morphs for a ridiculous price, uh, mainly because of the fact the guy was going away um, to Australia in a couple of days time so I snapped it up and I grabbed myself five snakes um, in the space of about two or three days and it only cost me about 100 150 pounds which is a great great steal so really do recommend checking that out there is a second best thing which is pre-loved now pre-loved um, is a site on the U in the UK uh, I'm sure there's loads of sites around the world that offer the same thing and um, it's when people are either just selling their animals because they can't cope with the animal anymore or because of personal reasons or whether they're just the same as the forum itself they're just breeding snakes and they're selling them so that's another great site to check out um, just be careful uh, the people you're um, buying it from just do your checks there are some reviews on the person as well so make sure if they've got reviews check them out reptile forums number one pre-loved number two um, but steer clear of outlets like jollies and pets at home uh, for food that they're fine for food um, for the actual animals themselves i wouldn't go there myself so just heed that warning and that's it if you've got this far guys i'd like to say thank you for watching my video and also thank you for watching uh, my previous videos on my channel i am going to be doing a new project where i'm going to be trying to breed my ball pythons for the first time so i'm hoping that you guys can tune in and watch me and see if i can actually get any eggs at all or if i can even get the male to be interested in the female and so forth so i hope you guys can stay tuned for that and i'll catch you in the next video see you later